Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to download Oracle um, XE, the free edition, into your Ubuntu virtual machine. So, log in into your Ubuntu virtual machine first. Oh, hang on, I think I've input focus. I see it. Okay. And um, start up a browser. In this case, Firefox is provided. I'm just going to use that. Okay, and then um, just I'm just going to search Oracle XE. And the second link is what I want. The downloads. And click on Accept License Agreement. And then click on Linux X64 Edition. Okay, you have to sign in. Uh, if you don't have an account, please sign up for an account. Um, I just managed to retrieve my account. So I'm going to log in. And sign in. And just hit save file. Okay. And click OK. And it will take. Wow, well, not too bad. 300 megabytes, so that shouldn't take too long. Maybe a minute or so. I'm just going to pause the recording because it makes no sense for you to watch the uh, the. Okay, so I finished downloading. It says finish, so um, I'm done. And I believe it goes into the download folder. You can check it using this uh, file utility, in the downloads. Um, oh, here it is. This is a zip file. Okay, but we're going to be using a um, a command line. So um, type terminal and hit this. Okay, and um, you are in you are in a prompt. Um, this is a terminal with a shell, and you're in your home directory, which contains these folders. Uh, go to the download directory by typing cd downloads. You can type tab to complete to do auto completion. Now, I uh, the zip file is the one that we downloaded. Um, this Oracle directory is something that I created earlier, and um, in fact. Um, what uh, I would like you guys to do is to actually create the Oracle directory. Uh, in this case, um, okay, I'm just going to I'm I'm actually going to delete off that that directory by doing rm dash rf Oracle. Now I want you now to create that directory because just to make life easier, mkdr um, Oracle, and I want you to move the zip file into that directory. So let's move the uh, Oracle zip file again. You can hit dash and then hit tab to auto complete into the Oracle directory. Okay, so now if you go into the Oracle directory, you will see the zip file there. Okay, so this is the point where we are going to start installing, and uh, the next video will be to install this.